On Wednesday, February 10th, 1999, the Big Island of Hawaii's double-hulled voyaging canoe, Makali, departed from Hawalalai Resort at historic Kaupulehu on her epic 7,200-mile Amau voyage to Micronesia. The purpose of Makali's historic voyage was to return Grand Master Navigator Mao Pialu home to his native island of Satawa in western Micronesia. Dr. Pius Mao Pialu first came to the islands of Hawaii 25 years ago to share with the people of Polynesia the ancient arts of non-instrument navigation, seafaring, wayfinding, and canoe building. These arts and skills have been set aside and not practiced by the people of Polynesia for over a hundred years. Mao's unselfish and generous sharing of these ancient arts and skills made possible the building of Hokulea, the first voyaging canoe built in Hawaii in over 150 years, and paved the way for Hokulea's first epic voyage to Tahiti. Because of Mao Pialu's willingness to share and teach, the ancient skills he possessed to anyone willing to learn. Mao, more than any one individual, set the stage for the rebirth of Hawaiian culture and arts enjoyed by all the people of Hawaii today. Mao Pialu, a kind, gentle, and humble man, asked only one thing in return for his gift of knowledge given so lovingly to all. His one wish that one day a Polynesian voyaging canoe would sail him home to his native island of Satawa and help him rekindle the spark of cultural awareness in his people before it was lost like it had been so so many years ago by the people of Polynesia. And so it was that the honor of repaying Mao's kindness and generosity to all the people of Polynesia was bestowed on the crew of Makali. For all of us who took part in sailing the Master home, did so knowing we not only represented Makali, Hokulea, Hawaii Loa, and the people of Hawaii, but we also voyaged for our brothers and sisters in New Zealand, Tahiti, the Cook Islands, and all the people of the Pacific whose cultures have been enriched because Mao Pialu shared his knowledge with us all. 
All of us, who over the years, have been fortunate enough to be instructed by or sailed with Mao Pialu, have learned that the canoe is our mother, constantly nurturing all who sail on her. For all of us who have come to know and respect Mao the man, he has become like a father to us all, for in his heart is the spark of knowledge renewed.